subscribe and download over 1 million code snippet including this tutorial from codegive.com, link in the description below. Visual Studio Code, VS Code, is a popular code editor with excellent support for Python development. One crucial step in setting up a Python project in VS Code is selecting the appropriate Python interpreter. The interpreter is the engine that executes your Python code. Follow this tutorial to learn how to select a Python interpreter in Visual Studio Code. Before you start, ensure you have Visual Studio Code installed. You can download it from https colon slash slash code dot visuals to dio dot com. Next, install the Python extension for Visual Studio Code. Open VS Code, go to the extensions view by clicking on the extensions icon in the activity bar on the side of the window, or use the keyboard shortcut Ctrl plus Shift plus X search for Python and install the one provided by Microsoft. Now, either open an existing Python project in VS Code or create a new one. If you're creating a new project, you can do so by opening a terminal in VS Code, Ctrl plus, and using the following commands. Creating a virtual environment is a good practice to isolate your project dependencies. To create a virtual environment, run the following command in the terminal. Activate the virtual environment. Open the command palette by pressing Ctrl plus Shift plus P. Type and select Python, select interpreter. A list of detected Python interpreters will be displayed. Choose the one that corresponds to your project or virtual environment. After selecting the interpreter, VS Code will create a settings.json file in the .vs code folder of your project, storing the interpreter information. To verify that you've successfully selected the Python interpreter, open a Python file in your project and look at the lower right corner of the VS Code window. You should see the selected interpreter version. Congratulations! You have successfully selected a Python interpreter in Visual Studio Code. This ensures that your Python code runs in the correct environment with the specified dependencies. ChatGPT